And uh, there is a, a demonstration uh, tonight, in fact a party with several hundred opponents of Margaret Thatcher gathering in London's Trafalgar Square. Let's go to Andrew Plant who joins us from there now. Uh, the rain is putting a dampener on there, any sort of sense of celebration. Uh, Andrew, how many people are there and where have they come from? Tim, they've come from all around the country, people here from uh, the far north of England and also from uh, places like Cornwall and Devon too. Let me just show you why they're here. Uh, this poster said it all, privatise the cost of Thatcher's funeral out to the lowest bidder. They're demonstrating here against the fact that Margaret Thatcher will be having a state funeral uh, here in London uh, on Wednesday. Let me just show you what's going on. We've got probably somewhere in the region of 400 people here. It's difficult to estimate, uh, but they've got an effigy of Margaret Thatcher over here and despite that rain, there's about 100 people around 6 o'clock. Uh, they have slowly, slowly swelled here in Trafalgar Square in front of the uh, National Gallery to around, as I say, about 400. Lots of banners here too. But if we just spin you around uh, this way, you can also see how heavy the police presence is over here by the lines, and that is typical of all the offshoots around here at Trafalgar Square. Uh, that's largely because this demonstration, uh, this party, as you called it, has been organised on social media, on Twitter, on Facebook, and uh, some of the messages on there are really inciting people uh, to come here uh, and get loud, get noisy and demonstrate against that uh, state funeral being given to Margaret Thatcher here in London on Wednesday. At the moment, though, I should say all completely yeah, peaceful, yeah. Uh, but a lot of fears, uh, I think, among the police uh, that this could turn into something else. At the moment, though, it really hasn't. Now, uh, the, the uh, Boris Johnson, the mayor of London, saying that uh, if anyone here did riot, they would be uh, dealt with, also questioning why so many people should rejoice, in his words, at the death of an 87-year-old. What people here have been saying is that uh, on Wednesday they will be turning up to her funeral. The plan is, they say, to turn their back on the cortege. The streets around London will be closed Yay! and as her coffin goes on a, a gun carriage, a horse-drawn carriage towards St Paul's, uh, they intend to turn their back on the funeral cortege. Here, though, at the moment, a lot of people are just holding their banners uh, and demonstrating uh, that effigy there as well of Margaret Thatcher, as you can see. Uh, but at the moment, Tim, all uh, completely peaceful here in Trafalgar Square. All right, uh, Andrew, thank you very much. Uh, just one correction, actually. Uh, not, a, not a state uh, funeral for Margaret Thatcher, but uh, uh, a funeral with the full military honours taking place uh, on Wednesday. Uh, full coverage here on the BBC News Channel, of course.